Hello there. Zero 360 was at Wise Accra, the largest gathering of stakeholders and leaders in the education industry. We had the opportunity to talk to some of the guests at the event about some of the problems in our education system and some of the solutions we can implement to ensure quality education in Africa. I am Patrick Iwa. I'm the president and founder of Ashesi University. It feels absolutely fantastic to have been awarded a presidential charter. So I think the most exciting thing about it is that we get to, to offer our own certificates to students. And so I'm very happy for my students. Um, they've been waiting uh, a long time to get you know, certificates that have the name of their alma mater on it. I do think that our students who go into academia, who um, get their PhDs, are going to be capable of returning to Ashesi and teaching there and rising up the ranks of the faculty. Um, those who are going on a more management path will also be able to return and be on the administrative side of the university. So there's certainly a capability there. And I think one of my biggest roles as a founder is to really make sure that we have good governance systems in place and that we have a good system for conducting a search um, and recruitment of the next president, both externally and internally in the organization. I think that the, the areas for improvement in the educational system would include uh, really focusing on um, moving away from rote learning to an approach that fosters more critical thinking and problem solving. Um, and I also think that there's a lot of room for improvement in, in ethics and really having university campuses and school campuses generally be places, that, uh, places where students themselves own a culture of integrity and are very keen and anxious to, to build that sort of community of trust within their campus and have this sensibility that when they graduate, they're going to be leading important enterprise, they're going to be leaders in the public sector, and that their character and their conduct is going to be very important for the future of the country. Fifty percent of our students are on scholarship. 30% don't pay anything, 20% pay partial fees, and then 50% pay their own way. It's a combination of philanthropy and a commitment by the university that if we have any surplus income, we plow it back into the institution and we plow it back into scholarships, we plow it back into investments in infrastructure and so on. I think we have to, across the, across the educational spectrum, we have to really uh, focus on, first, the quality of education for teachers um, and the pedagogy, the pedagogy or the teaching philosophy that teachers employ in the classroom is going to be very important. But we also need to think about how we manage our educational institutions, right? So part, part of the issue with quality is a management problem. So if the head of a school is not insisting that teachers come to work. That's a management issue. Or if the head of the school is allowing you know, corporal punishment of kids, which turns a lot of kids off learning, that's a management issue at its core. And so we also have to think about it as a management issue. Um, and the same with even just maintaining the infrastructure and making sure that there are resources and that funds are uh, sort of deployed in an efficient way. Uh, so we, we need to pay attention to all of the above.